Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So the Colossus and Deadpool X-Force Arena Round 1 is over. Now, I have both of these champions, so I did not go for either of them. I just went for Milestones. Uh, but we're going to take a look at the leaderboards and see if we see any names that we recognize. Now, you can see I've already started on the Sunday Arena. Uh, I've just run my six stars through here, and I might run some five stars uh, later on uh, tonight, maybe tomorrow. We'll find out. Uh, depends on how tired I feel after this. All right, but let's go ahead and hit these uh, arenas here. And for the five star arena, I always go for the 5,000 shards. I'm still saving up so that I can open up some featured crystals when Apocalypse enters the featured five-star pool. All right. And the three-star, we always get the three-star now. As long as you do the final milestone of any of the featured arenas, you will get the three-star uh, featured champion. All right. And four-star featured, I just do milestones. Four-star basic, I just do milestones. But sometimes you accidentally get the champion when he goes very, very low. Uh, let's start with that arena. So I put up 1.533. So 33,000 points over the uh, top milestone got me the champion. Uh, what happens a lot of times is I will uh, get the milestone on maybe the first fight, and then I'll just keep doing the next few fights so that I could finish off the round. Sometimes this happens, especially with Deadpool X-Force. Nobody wants him. He is a useless champion for the most part. Um, he definitely could use a rework for sure. All right, let's see who might have actually got him by accident. But we're going to see the top 200. Uh, Black Gamer. Uh, I don't know. Congratulations. Uh, some people just go for uh, the champion's especially if they don't have them. And I was one of those people. If I didn't have a champion, didn't matter, even Deadpool X-Force, I'll go for him. Uh, but depending on where you're at in the game, uh, although I called him useless, he does have a uh, guaranteed bleed, so he's not completely useless. Also, um, he has a good synergy, so people may want to pick him up for his synergy. We uh, we don't know. We will see. Um, I believe uh, with Nick Fury. I think so. All right. Let's see if we see anybody else in here. I, I really wonder. Uh, I, I have to believe that uh, the names I'm seeing here, they're either picking him up for the synergy or for just collection purposes. Uh, the bleed that he has doesn't even stack. So there's many better bleed champions than he is. Uh, he doesn't have any uh, immunities. He's just in need of a bad rework. Uh, I remember when I picked him up uh, for the first time way back in the day. I was so happy. Uh, woo, Gray Wolf. Uh, congratulations. You must not have had him. Um, I was, I was so happy because I knew one thing, Deadpool had a crazy regen and I heard a lot of people talking about Deadpool's regen in the game. I didn't realize there were two Deadpools and I still don't have the red Deadpool. Uh, you had to spend money to get entry into an arena and especially at that time, there was no way uh, I would have, you know, spent the money, but I wouldn't have been able to get him in the arena. My my roster was just not there. Now, if that happens, I might be able to actually pick him up, you know, just for collecting uh, purposes. All right. Now we've got the four star featured and Colossus. Now he recently got a rework and his rework was phenomenal. Uh, right after uh, his rework, and I started playing around with him a little bit, 
uh, I took my five star to rank five and I still have no regrets. Uh, Black Gamer, congratulations again. All right. Uh, right now, I mainly have him on uh, defense, but in between war and uh, AQ, I will bring him out sometime uh, for questing. But yeah, no regrets. He is a beast now. Uh, people coming back to the game. Uh, it's funny to, uh, you know, hear them talk about Colossus not realizing he got a rework because he used to be really bad. He went from zero to hero in that rework. Uh, and it's reworks like that that give me some hope. Uh, Kabam is committing to uh, reworking champions on an increased schedule. And if they do as good of a job uh, with those reworks as they've done with Colossus, we're going to get a nice little refresh of our rosters. May have some people uh, that we don't even use right now that suddenly will be worth it. Uh, they've reworked uh, Falcon recently, and he is much, much better. Some people uh, have gotten him as a six star and taken him to rank three. All right, Coat Hanger, congratulations. Uh, so his rework was awesome. So yeah, I have a lot of hope in some uh, revitalization of a lot of these champions. And of course, the one that would be top on my list is Hulk. Justice for Hulk, hashtag justice for Hulk. All right, and that is it, the top 200 now. In this arena, it is actually the top 800 that get the champion. So 600 people that we haven't seen got the champion. And if you are one of those, don't be shy. Leave a comment. Let us know what you put up, what your ranking was. And congratulations on picking you up a Colossus, a true tank. All right, so the five-star... I put up around that same score every time, 23, 22. Uh, if I don't feel like it, I might not finish off. The reason that I went as high as I did here is because there was an arena wins event that happened after I was pretty much done with all of my arenas. So I'm like, well, let me just at least finish my six stars to get a few more extra points. That's why you usually see a score like that. Otherwise, I could have stopped at like 22 and just, you know, relaxed. All right. Let's see who else we got here. Prof Hoff, congratulations. Rank 32. Not bad, not bad at all. And Debo, rest in peace, my friend. Not that Debo, but, you know, the uh, guy that played Debo. All right. Uh, let's see. No, 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 no. No. I, I figure he went pretty low. Uh, Ben Riley, congratulations, man. Um, I figure he went low because, I don't know, he's an old champion, even though his rework uh, makes him really, really good. You know, um, a lot of people already have him. But if you don't have him, I would say if you can at all possible go all out. Black Gamer in all of these uh, arenas, man. Congratulations. Hitting them leaderboards. Uh, if you can go for him, he is worth it. He is definitely a worthy addition to your roster. He is crazy good now. All right. Uh, if I had not already gotten him, um, and I got him a long time ago, uh, way before his rework. So if I didn't have him, I would have definitely uh, gone for him in this arena. Uh, Hades, congratulations, my friend. All right. And there's the 150. For the longest time, it was 150 
got the champion and everybody else just was out of luck. But now it's top 300. So everybody here in all of the leaderboards got the champion. We no longer see those who missed barely. Um, but one of the things, uh, I, I do miss the moment of silence. However, it does make these videos go much, much faster because uh, there's not as much editing, all right? Uh, I used to have to then add the audio, you know, make sure I, I cropped it, add the text in there saying the song, but because they decided to uh, claim copyrights after so long of using it, um, I'm having to go back, remove it. I removed it out of my playlist uh, for my live streams, just in case. Uh, but I had already stopped using it because they increased the cutoff to the top 300. And we no longer see people who, you know, just missed. But anyway, that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. Uh, definitely leave a comment and let everyone know what scores you put up, what rankings you got. Take care and you all have a blessed day.